Hello, it's Helen from Journal With Purpose and welcome to my latest video. Today, I'm really excited to share with you an unboxing from Tapeology. I'd not heard of them before, but they contacted me and asked if I would either like to select some things from their shop or go for a surprise. And I thought it'd be fun to go for a surprise. So this has just arrived with me. And I can't wait to get everything out and share it with you. And I've also got a 15% discount code to share with you as well, which I'll talk about a bit later on. And of course, leave all of the details linked below the video. So I'm gonna start off by getting everything out of the box. And I'll tell you what each of the products are and they'll be linked separately down below in case there's anything you fancy. But there will also be an extra link which just includes, if you click on that, will just take you to everything that I've got within this box. So hopefully that will help and a normal link to the shop in case you just want to have a good browse around and see what's on offer. I absolutely love it when I get the opportunity to try out products from a different shop and with such a gorgeous selection which just seemed so appropriate to my style of journaling. So I'm going to start off with these. These are leaf and floral transfer stickers. I absolutely love using these in my journals because you use the little stick to rub them on and transfer the prints onto your paper and so they've got absolutely no backing at all so they look like they were actually already on your paper and these are really gorgeous i love the different colors in these lots of what look like wildflowers some autumnal leaves so i think these will be absolutely gorgeous what i'm hoping to do is hopefully next week or if not the week after do a journal with me using some of these products as well so that you can see them in use next we have this lovely selection of stickers that look like dried flowers so i've got two leaf packs and two florals and I'm gonna get some out of the packaging to make sure that you can hopefully see them properly without the packaging picking up the glare of the light. And these are just beautiful. They really do look just like pressed flowers. Again, I think they're gonna make absolutely perfect addition to my journal pages. And I love having the leafy selections as well. Really, really lovely. The next pack I have here is some frame stickers. We'll have a little look at these. I tried not to open anything up before the unboxing, I just opened the box quickly because I wanted to make sure we could look at them together. So these will be wonderful. So this middle bit here will pop out. So that would be really lovely actually for doing something like having some flowers underneath or a photo that you've taken. I think these will be great fun. So by the looks of it, lots of different styles of frames. Oh, that one's beautiful, I love the colours in that. I can already think of lots of possibilities, doing little handwritten quotes in those, doing cutouts on your journal pages so you've got a little frame through to the page underneath. Yeah, I think these will be great fun to play with and I love this kind of vintage style and torn edge look to them. Next up, we've got some butterfly vellum stickers. And these are so pretty. Considering this was a surprise box, I did say some of my favorite things and they'd clearly already had a look at my journal pages, but these are just perfect for me. 
these are so pretty and I've had to transfer uh, transparent butterfly stickers before but never any on vellum these are gorgeous I love butterflies I use them a lot in my journal pages oh that's good the backs come off nice and easily and it's got that lovely kind of frosty vellum look to it absolutely beautiful This next pack I'm really intrigued by. So this is handmade mesh paper. little belly band I'll be saving that to use in my journal I love things that are different that are really going to encourage me to have a think about how I want to use them in my journals these are so pretty really fine they feel to how to describe it almost delicate and sturdy at the same time there's lots of sheets of different styles in here. That's really pretty there with the snowflakes on it. I think these will be so much fun, particularly I'm thinking perhaps in a junk journal, maybe as a background, including some in a collage. I think they'd also be really fun to play around with in my art journal, because if you were to put a bit of gesso over part of this, I think the textures you'd pick up from the different mesh would give a really interesting look. So I'm just so excited to have a play. I think sometimes when you're in, if you're feeling a little bit of a rut and you get some an unusual supply, it can just take you in a whole different direction where you just start playing around and trying different things out and just experimenting with supplies. I think that's such a lovely thing to do if you do it with no particular expectation of what you want from the results but yeah I think these are just going to be a lot of fun to play with got some gorgeous colors in here I've had handmade papers before but certainly nothing quite like this yeah really beautiful so lovely having a surprise pack I nearly picked things, but I thought, no, a surprise would be wonderful. Okay, here we have another paper pack, and this one is called a Laces Doilies paper pack. So we'll have a look at these. Again, these are really pretty. I couldn't tell what they were in the pack, but once you can see the actual details through them, I see now why they're called doilies. Absolutely stunning. Again, gonna be great for collaging and including in my art journals. Such fun. I'm actually filming this on a Friday and I'm so excited it's the weekend because I'm gonna have a little bit of time to hopefully start playing around with some of these. Okay, this one is described as a notepad papers pack. Not quite sure what to expect from this one, but the front one looks really pretty. So these are card stock. I love the colours and the de and the really delicate decoration on this front one. These will be perfect for using as little tags and tipping cards. So pretty having that white on top of the pink. And there's absolutely loads in this pack. It's really thick. 
lots of different cards here. It's so pretty and I love how you've got all these different colour palettes in there as well. So now I've sort of moved into some green colours. These are so pretty. And again, I've got quite a few different tags and ephemera pieces from over the years, but nothing quite like these. Just so delicate. I hope you're enjoying seeing these as much as I am. I'm absolutely mesmerised looking through all of these. They're so beautiful and these just couldn't be more perfect for me either. So this next one is a lace frames material pack. I did mention to them that I love working with fabrics inside my journals, so I'll have a little look at these. Oh, these are so pretty, really delicate. These will be lovely for decorating probably the outsides of journal pages, some inside, attaching to the tops of tags. I'm going to try not to make a massive mess with all of these, but I want to make sure you get a good feel for the types of laces that are in here. Just so pretty. And I'm actually working slowly, but I'm working on a fabric journal at the moment and I think these will be so nice to include in there. Really lovely selections of colours and patterns. And I've been doing quite a lot of slow stitching as well and I think they'd be nice to incorporate into that. And I've got some rolls of lace, but it's so nice to have this selection of all these different types here. I do have a friend that I did a little swap with as well with some different fabrics so I think it would be nice to do a little swap with some laces as well. It's so nice when you find people that are into similar things to you and you can pop little treasures like this in the post. Absolutely beautiful. Under here, I feel like I'm burying everything. <laughs> so these are some sticky notes. Again, a really big pack. There's still some in there. Again, lots of different frames and tags. Perfect as well. These are sticky, so I can just peel the backing off. And I love using things like this, again, to add little quotes or if I put a photo in, to either put the photo on the frame or to make a few notes about where we've been underneath. These will definitely be well used. Such a big selection again as well. All sorts of different frames and different sizes. So yeah, absolutely loads of them in there. So this wasn't listed on the content, so I think it's probably just a little freebie that's been popped in, so we'll have a look at this. That's lovely, so that's some neutral fabric, I'd say it feels possibly like calico. That could be really fun, again, to use inside my fabric journal. That would be great as a base layer, perhaps even to do some stenciling and painting on top of. So definitely everything in here is going to be getting used, which is wonderful. 
Okay, so we've got two more packs to go, and this is a pack of floral tags. I think you can never have too many tags and embellishments you can add to your journals. Oh, and these have got the little holes which pop out, which is really handy for being able to add some of your string or twine or ribbon through the top. Really pretty. Yeah, absolutely love those. So, and finally, we have a junk journal paper pack. So this says it's the vintage collection. So I've got some vellum in here, different embellishments, music papers, old adverts. Absolutely love this. Definitely perfect for junk journaling. And I think I'll probably use some of these in my altered book as well, which I am still plowing on with. I'm probably three quarters of the way through that. I ought to share that again soon, actually. But yeah, some really, really beautiful embellishments in here. Just gonna be so lovely to use inside my junk journal. Yeah, all sorts of different papers, articles, so interesting to look through. Well, I really do hope you've enjoyed seeing all of these beautiful products from Table Orgy. I think they're absolutely stunning and I'm chuffed to bits that they contacted me and asked if I'd like to try out some of their products. As I mentioned, I'll leave everything linked down below and you can use the code HELEN15 to get a 15% discount at any time. So again, I'll leave all of those details linked down below, along with the links to each of the individual products in case there's anything there that you fancied, and the shop in case you just want to have a good browse and look at all of the lovely papers and fabrics that they've got available. Well, thank you ever so much for watching. I hope you're doing well. I look forward to speaking with you really soon in my next video.